day an absolute perfect day for what we have planned oh I've gone really dark we are going on a mini holiday a little break away and I am so excited the girls have absolutely no idea like I said through the week we like to keep things a secret and then surprise them literally last minute and I am so excited for them to finish school today if you are daily watchers of our channel you will know that we are going somewhere we've never been before we're staying in something we've never stayed in before and I hope that's kind of kept you all in suspense and made you all excited to find out what we're doing should we tell them now what we're doing no 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 <gasps> Chris is being mean guys I want to tell you where we're going but I've got to respect the husband you'll have to wait and see we're staying in a log cabin Sorry, it just blurted out. You I've got to tell them. Psycho. <laughs> We're staying in a log cabin. I am so excited. It's like my all time absolute dream place to stay. A cute little log cabin with a, what they're called, burnt log burner. With a log burner so we can make s'mores and, and a hot tub on the veranda or balcony, whatever you call them. You guys need to stay tuned because the girls are going to freak out when they see it. I am so excited. It's going to be the best surprise ever. We're staying just for the weekend because the girls have school obviously today and next week so we're just staying for the weekend but we're really excited and we're so excited to take you guys along with us. I also just want to say really quickly, I meant to do it last night, a big hello and welcome to all of our new iFams, all of our new subscribers. We've been gaining lots over the last couple of weeks and I like to just take a minute to say a big warm welcome to all of you guys. We hope you enjoy our channel and we hope you stick around to see all of our family fun adventures starting today. Oh, and just to add on what we're doing today, we're only telling the girls when we pick them up from school what we're actually doing. We're telling them that we're going on a little breakaway and we're staying in no, we're not even going to tell them what we're staying in. No. No, we've got to keep it all a secret. We're just going to tell them we're going on a little holiday. We're staying in the woods maybe and it's a surprise. We're not going to tell them anything else, especially not tell them about the hot tub because they're just going to think that's the best thing ever. Right now we are just pulling up to, I'm going pitch black again. Right now we're just pulling up to the petrol station, we're going to get some petrol. Let me just move that hair because it's bugging me. And then, <laughs> you messed up, you should let me drive. I can't get petrol from here. <laughs> oh no. Yeah, so we're just getting petrol right now. We're going to go over to the pound shop because I want to get the girls some goggles because there's a hot tub and the girls like goggles. I don't really want to bring as many swimming ones as they'll get lost. And then we're going to get some fun snacks and then we'll be on our way to pick up the girls from school. Are you excited? Very, very excited. Me I can't too. wait. The car's already packed, which is why it looks a bit busy down there. But yeah. <gasps> exciting times we are done with shopping for this weekend we just called back home because Chris wants to upload the vlog for tonight so that I mean it only takes 10 minutes from home on super fast but on the road it sometimes takes a little bit longer because you're moving around and things so we've got about half an hour to pick up the girls from school and we just decided to call home and upload the vlog so then that's done all set up and definitely won't be late tonight I just thought I would sit out here because it's so calm and peaceful and it's actually really quite warm there is a slight breeze but it's really nice and warm and I'm liking that I can sit outside with no coat on 
If anybody is in the street looking at me right now, they're probably going to think, what on earth is she doing sat at the side of the road, <laughs> talking to herself into a camera? I don't care because it's lovely. The sun is beating down on my face right now and it's so warm. I kind of want to sunbathe. Look who's come to join me and sit in the sun. Yes, she still does have a partially discoloured face. She has been washed since her little orange hair dye incident but it's stained so we need to wash her again tonight we didn't we did do it once it didn't completely get rid of it but it's not good for dogs to continually wash the same place and we don't want to irritate her skin and the coloring's not bothering her so we'll probably wash that again tonight she's happy pretty come here baby hello say hello i fam say hello i fam hello <laughs> We need to keep a close eye on her this weekend because she, as I've mentioned before, is on heat and luckily there's no dogs around here so she's pretty safe. But yeah, we've got a lead and everything to take with us. Prinny, come on, stay with me. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. You are so cute. Look at this puppy. Look at you and your little miscoloured face. Look at your miscoloured face. You look like someone's wee weed on you. <laughs> we are just collecting the girls from school. Hello, my darlings. Hello. Oh, oh, Hello, so much. What for? I brought Avery for you to have a little hold on. Thank you so much. You're welcome. And um, what's in, in that bag? Which bag? That bag. Oh, it's just lunch. Mummy? Yes. Lunch. Did you not eat at school today? No. <laughs> yes, you did. Sit back two minutes. You all right, Isabel? Yes. Did you have a good day? You're looking very beautiful. Who had a good day at school? Me. Oh, it's hard to get you all in. We need to move that coat hanger rack. Yeah. That's really annoying. I don't know how to do that, but we definitely need to move that. Oh, yeah, you can. You just pop it out. Can you? Can you do it? No. No. <laughs> Maybe we'll leave that to Dad because we don't want to break it and get into trouble. The girls want to know what we're doing this evening, Daddy. Should we tell them yeah. or yeah. not? Something really boring. Go on, Daddy, you can tell them what we're doing instead. Basically, we thought it's really nice weather, so we thought we might go out and do something instead. Um, we basically thought that we might just um, go on holiday till Monday and not go home this weekend. Right now? Right now. <laughs> we're not going home. Uh, we're not going? sleeping at home either. <laughs> I can't, can't tell, tell you where we're going. But we're not sleeping at home. The car's full. All weekend the car's packed of everything we need. Even your phone. Everything we need. And we're not going home. We're going on a holiday. We're right now. We're, we're going to stay in some woods. A proper adventure holiday. Is it like log cabins? Yeah. 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 <gasps> An hour and a half in. Okay, it's fine. So, Not too long. I've only got one thing to say. Surprise! <laughs> Who's excited? Me. Me. Let's go and have some awesome family fun. So after just stopping for dinner on the road after being in traffic for so long I needed to show you guys this because it is just the best sunset I've ever seen. Boom. to get back on the road 
good after a very filling dinner. We actually stopped at Huckleberry's on the A64, so the York Huckleberry's, and we didn't film it because we kind of went there last night, as you guys saw. We did eat slightly healthier today. <coughs> We did eat slightly healthier today, but I just want to say how absolutely lovely, my window's it? how absolutely lovely the staff are in there. The restaurant was spotlessly clean, really nice and cool inside, but yeah, the staff were just so lovely, weren't they? All really friendly, really jolly and nice, and I don't know, I kind of, I've, I, we've passed there quite a few times, that restaurant, and I never knew it was actually a Huckleberry's, and they were just telling me that it's the, it was actually the first one in the UK, is that right? Yeah. The first one in the UK, and I think sometimes diners like that on motorways, I don't know about you, but sometimes I'm a little bit put off by them, because I always feel like they might not be as good quality as other places, which is so silly, but that's just the way I think. But after going there, so lovely really nice amazing staff so if any of you are watching this thank you very much really really great dinner now it's coming up to half past six and i am sad to say that our vlog is slightly late because despite our huge efforts this morning like i told you we went back home <coughs> when chris was exporting it the, his mac was full memory so it didn't export properly and exporting it takes a couple of hours so we had to export it on the road and then like I told you it's really hard to get a signal when you're on the road however we are going to stop again the reason we stopped at Huckleberry's by the way was because everyone was hungry and we'd been sat in traffic but also in the hopes that we could upload the vlog we got in there and they had no signal on the wi-fi like zero so we stuffed our dinner down really quickly we're now back on the road and we're going to stop just up here somewhere where we have 4g for around 15 minutes 20 minutes until the vlog uploads then we're about half an hour away from our destination we've just got here about to check in not sure if you can see me in the dark, it is extremely dark up here. The lady who booked this for us said that it was, there's no kind of natural light. There's no, well sorry, there's only natural light up here. There's no artificial light, so it's extremely dark in the dark to bring torches. So you probably can't see me right now, but oh my goodness, there is a zillion stars above me right now. I've just been and checked in at the reception over there. Our cabin is just a short drive just down there. We're literally in the middle of nowhere, in the middle of a big forest. And I just wish you guys could see the stars. It's insane. I'm so excited to see our cabin right now. All right, guys, we're just outside the cabin now. We've just pulled up. Man, everyone look up at the stars. Look how many stars are out, guys. It's insane. It's so dark. I'll have to do you a detailed outside tour tomorrow. Let's do it. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Oh, wow. my God. Oh, it's beautiful. Oh, my God. I'm from selfie sofa. <laughs> it's mega. Look at these. Oh, look. Because we're on holiday packs. That was so cool. During your stay, yeah. best yeah. wishes, Samantha and the Cropton team. This is that is so cool. Look how gorgeous it is. It is absolutely beautiful. Look at that window. Look how cute. Oh, it's getting too cold. Whoa. Surprise! Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Look at this! 
<laughs> We've got our very own. <laughs> our very own hot tub, you guys. <laughs> and it's massive. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, this is insane. This is so amazing. This is like the best thing I've we're gonna go on the hot tub, Esme. Come on, pretty. Come on. Come on, pretty. Come on. Come on. Good girl. Oh my god, I'm so happy right now. I wanna live here. You guys, we've got our hot tub. <laughs> Are you guys happy? Wait, yes. We haven't looked at the bedrooms, I know. <laughs> oh, that's so pretty, girls. I love it. We've got some towels. That is really lovely. We do. What? I love that bathroom. That bathroom is really nice. Oh, Pretty's having a good sniff in the toilet. Oh, another twin room as well. This is so nice. Look how beautiful they are. Oh my gosh, Isabel. Whoa. Oh, another bathroom. We've got another bathroom with a shower and a toilet. And this is my and mum's bedroom, I guess. Yeah, we've got dressing gowns. That's so cool. Oh, I love it, Esme. Ready? Watch for me. I actually think this is the best. This is the nicest place we've ever stayed ever. <laughs> you want to go to the hot tub now? Okay. We are just going out to have a little half an hour in the hot tub. I got the girls some goggles. They don't know about these. They'll probably be pretty excited when I show them to them. The girls are so hyper. It's insane. It's my guys. What is going on with that? Make right there. Let me just sort this out. There we go. Right. I'm going to show the girls these goggles and we're going to play in the hot tub for a little bit, even though it's about 8 pm. <laughs> Esme? Yeah. What is it? Goggles. Oh, God. Mind the blue. As you mind the red. <laughs> okay. <laughs> They are way, way excited. Oh, it's cold. It's freezing. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna keep that closed. Oh, 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 it's so peaceful out here. Oh, girls! Oh, oh, it's hot, but my feet are cold, so it feels weird. Is it nice? Yes. Go, go, he wants it. He wants it. Oh, I can't I was like, go. Jeez. Ah, Freezing. This is like. <gasps> Look at how it looks so cute. Okay, this let me so get in. Can you get in the deep with Daddy? Lily? One minute, let me just it put our hot. phones it's and things down. It's extremely hot. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna open that. Oh, that's quite hot. Oh, oh. Yeah. Is it nice though? Oh, it is nice. One minute, Lily, sweetheart. Can you get in the deep with Daddy? Ow, 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 ow. Wait. Woo -hoo. Woo -hoo. Now, Isabel, tell me, is there a better way to spend a Friday night? No. <laughs> no. There's not. Wow. I've literally got makeup all down my face. I don't know how that happened. It's <laughs> just stay in my It's just a mascara, Renee. Prinny, are you okay? Oh, I feel sorry for her. Prinny. Prinny, are you okay? Tomorrow. <laughs> this is be too hot for my Prinny. 
This place is so amazing. I know you can't see because it's so dark right now, right now out here. But just here, Mum, two seconds, darling. Just here, you can't see, it, but it's literally the most amazing tallest trees ever yeah. and just forest it looks gorgeous and it's so clear tonight but you can just see a bazillion a batillatoon stars above us it's absolutely beautiful i can look at the stars it's so nice isn't it gorgeous esme come here is it relaxing sorry sweetheart watch i'm gonna go in this pool i'm gonna go in this pool Watch me. Yeah, you're like that. Watch Tyler. Yeah, yo, watch me. Watch me. Okay. Watch you. Whoa! Clever girl. Clever girl, Isla. <laughs> 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 Clever girl, Isla. <laughs> That's so good. I'm going to spin around with my legs off the floor. I'm just going to look at my piggy. Just in there. Diggy! Diggy! Watch Diggy! Yep. Woo! Wow, where's me? That's amazing! Let's see how long. You're doing it, you're gonna time me? One That's minute. So cool. Well, well done, Esme. Well, I was going. I was freaking out. Ready? Let's see how long I can stay in the water. Okay, baby, without go for it. Without holding my nose. Okay? Go for it. Yeah. I can do it without holding my nose. Without holding my nose, my goggles okay. on. Ready? That's easy. Oh no, not on my nose. Ready? Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-four. That was really good, Isabel. Forest Holidays 2017. Here we go, baby. Could you fill that up anymore, like? Thank you. We're celebrating tonight. Yay! Cheers, everyone. Let's get our big Cheers, We're celebrating Yay! YouTube full time. <laughs> Boom. Prini is being so sweet right now. I'm stood outside of the hot tub. We've been watching her go crazy on the sofa for the last 20 minutes. And now she's finally settled on one spot, the spot where my jeans are, and she can smell her daddy, and she's going to sleep. She's such a cutie. The girls want to show me a dance. Are you ready, guys? You guys are crazy! Check out my forest holidays robe. This place, I had absolutely no expectations whatsoever coming here, but this place has blown me away so much. Thank you so much, forest holidays. Just to let you all know, I'm never leaving. Never ever going home. This place is my new home now. And I know we're only here for the weekend, but I literally never want to go home. We're coming back. <laughs> I never want to go home. We've been here two hours and I never want to leave. This place is just absolutely perfect. So on the way up here, we bought Prinny a new one of these. She absolutely love, loves hers at home, but she's lost it. We can't find it anywhere. So we bought her a new one and got her some treats. So we're going to sort her out with it now. Here you go, Prinny. What have I got for you, darling? We got you a new one of these, sweetheart. There you go. Your favourite. That's right. Guys, I've messed up. It's the next day. Unfortunately, the memory card that I used to film everything on last night, putting the girls to bed, Isla fell asleep really cutely. Me and Sarah did a really awesome ending to last night's vlog. I put that memory card into the drone this morning and formatted it, only to realise that I'd messed up and deleted all of the footage from last night. I'm absolutely devastated. Literally. Devastated. Anyway, so I'm ending the vlog here today. The next morning. I'm really sorry about that, guys. Comment of the day coming up now.
Today's question of the day comes from Helen White. Helen asked, is it hard vlogging your daily lives and what did the girls think of it when you first started doing so? This one's a really easy one to answer. The girls have always been filmed all of their lives since they were babies. Sarah and I have always filmed pretty much everything that they do each day. Kind of like daily vlogging but just for our own memories because obviously we weren't into YouTube back then, we didn't really know about YouTube back then. We weren't YouTubers back then. So we have years and years worth of videos and memories from the girls from vlogging them basically all of their lives. From them vlogging themselves, they've always used cameras themselves, especially Isabel. Isabel is incredibly talented at videography and she has a real eye for it and, and such a keen interest and passion for it too. She'll often tell me when I'm missing shots in a day. So for instance, if we go somewhere and there's a really beautiful sunset or a landscape, Isabel will always be like, Dad, you need to get that. You need to film that, that's really beautiful. She has got such a keen passion for it. She's, I'm really excited to, for the future, for to see how she goes with this and vlogging and videography and everything else because she's so creative and so talented at using a camera. The girls absolutely love using cameras and vlogging themselves and they always have done since they were young so it kind of isn't really anything new to them. As for me and Sarah, at first, yes, it kind of was hard, or not hard, but just some things were difficult, like for instance, getting used to walking through a shopping center and talking into a camera and having lots of people staring at you like you're an alien. That's a little bit difficult to get used to at first, but now it becomes over time just part of your daily life, just something that you do automatically without thinking about it. So for instance, now when I wake up on a morning, I don't think, oh, I need to vlog this or I need to vlog that. I just pick up the camera and do it automatically. Like it just happens automatic. I think once you've been doing something for a length of time, just like anything, once you've been doing it for a length of time, it just happens without you even thinking about it. Like you drive a car, you know, you just drive a car. You just do it without thinking about it really, don't you? So that's just the same really with vlogging. It's just, it's just something that over time becomes second nature and becomes something that you just do like automatically. Anyway guys, I hope you've had a fantastic Saturday, no matter what you're doing in the world. Come back tomorrow night, it's a beautiful day here, the sun is shining, the sky is blue and it is full of potential and we're already having an incredible morning here at Forest Holidays. Until tomorrow night at 6pm, massive love from us all here. Good night. <laughs>